morning, everyone. Welcome to Science for Young Minds with Merivit Education Center. This series is for Padum 4. Let's learn some vocabulary words. All right. You will learn how to spell and pronounce some vocabulary words. Here are some vocabulary words for today. Are you ready? Here we go. Number one, fungi. Number two, bacteria. Number three, microscope. Number four, algae. Number five, decomposers. Please repeat the word after me. Fungi. Good job! Let's spell it. F U N G I. Fungi. Great! Fungi are different from plants because they do not have chlorophyll to carry out photosynthesis. Can you try reading the sentence on your own? Great! Please repeat the word after me. Bacteria Good job! Let's spell it! B A C T E R I A Bacteria! Great! Bacteria can be seen under a microscope. Can you try reading the sentence on your own? Great! Please repeat the word after me. Microscope Good job! Let's spell it. M-I-C-R-O-S-C-O-P-E Microscope. Great! We need a microscope to see microorganisms. Can you try reading the sentence on your own? Great! Please repeat the word after me. Algae. Good job! Let's spell it. A L G A E. Algae. Great! Some algae are used as food. Can you try reading the sentence on your own? Great! Please repeat the word after me. Decomposers. Good job! Let's spell it. D E C O M P O S E R S Decomposers 
Great. Fungi are the composers. Can you try reading the sentence on your own? Great! From the words and pictures earlier during our vocabulary, what do you think is our lesson for today? Good job! Our lesson for today is all about classification of other living things. In this lesson, you will learn about algae, fungi, and bacteria. Do you know anything about them? Don't worry, we will learn more about them. Do you still remember what are the two general classifications of living things? Yes, you're right. We classify them into plants and animals. But we have other living things that don't belong to these groups. Do you know what are they? We have fungi, bacteria, and algae. Have you seen a fungi? They are different from plants because they don't have chlorophyll. Thus, they can do photosynthesis. They get their food by breaking down dead organisms. Hence, fungi are decomposers and not producers. Have you been sick in the past? If so, do you know what caused it? Yes, you got it! Many times we get sick because of very tiny organisms called bacteria. We normally can't see them with just our eyes. We need microscope to see them. These are some examples of fungi. Do you know them? Here we have mushrooms, yeast, and molds. Bacteria comes in many shapes. When we look at them under a microscope, they may look spiral, rod-like, and spherical. Do you know what is common between algae and plants? Good job! Both algae and plants have chlorophyll, but unlike plants, algae do not have roots, stems, and leaves. Now, you know what makes them different from plants. These are examples of algae that includes the edible seaweed and kelp. Many of you like to eat the green edible seaweed. They are algae. Alright, let me know if you really understood our lesson. Get the word puzzle about other living things and answer it. Bring it on the first day of class. Thank you and see you next episode.